Alright, well, welcome back to Hollow Knight, everybody. We, uh, we've, 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 got, we've kind of gotten caught up with a bad crowd now. This, like, weird, creepy set of gypsies slash Circus Malurcus, uh Satan Death Cult has appeared in Dirtmouth, and they're like, Hey, can you help us kill some people and take their flames? And I'm like, oh, heck yeah, yes, please, I want to do that. And now I've got, well, a demon with me now. <laughs> hey -o, DX, welcome. This guy's taking my girlfriend. You know, canonically, the reason why I decided to join this death cult circus is because my girlfriend left me for this guy. <laughs> How could they be circus bugs? <laughs> they literally are circus bugs. That's a, that's actually very true. <laughs> okay, so where where do we need to go for the circus now? Oh, we should go to Queen's Gardens because apparently there's stuff there for us to do. Um, I don't think those are flames. Okay, there's a flame over in the resting grounds. That's interesting. And there's a flame, oh, in the far-off kingdom. Interesting. Oh, is that it? Okay. Well, I don't really want to hang out around these uh, forgotten... <laughs> I don't want to hang out around the corrupted forgotten crossroads. Hi, Proxima! Lovely to see you tonight. Welcome! I'm glad it's a Wednesday. I'll be happy when this work week is over. All right, let's let's head to the resting grounds and uh, help take out the <laughs> red flames for the Death Circus. Yes, this is a good plan. I like this very much. <laughs> He's like, be careful. <laughs> oh, we got no soul. Aw, oh, back to slower already, but you know that's fine. It's the journey that's what really matters. Oh yeah, there's also a grubby here. Oh ho, I see. Okay, well we'll we'll come back for that one. But first I got to deal with the uh, the circus. <laughs> Hi Mobius, welcome. Oh, I need to cheer you up. Okay. Let me try to think of a funny joke. Uh I really need a list of go-to jokes for just this kind of situation. I have a bunch of dumb jokes, but I'm looking for a good joke. I'll think about it while I fight this guy. Okay, this guy's easy. <laughs> I got the power! Oh. I jumped right into that one. Oh well. Oh! Oh! <laughs> what a sick dodge. I will definitely pretend I did that. Intentionally. Yeah! Uh-huh. Take that. Uh-huh. Yeah. Ooh. What kind of bug can you not trust? Spiders. Ah. Now, come on. Tell me that cheered you up for the whole evening, right? Clever joke. Please laugh. A humbug is also an acceptable answer. Oh, no. He's actually hitting me. It's okay. Aha! Flame consumed. You eat well tonight, my friend. <laughs> the movies! That joke was an utter disaster. Haha! <laughs> yes, come, come ye all who are lonely. <laughs> Join Artie's stream. I cannot promise it will be good, but I can promise that you are with company. <laughs> oh no! I used up my soul! Is there hot springs around here? And if not, why not? I can't actually destroy that without my soul. Um... Maybe there's a hot spring over in the Spirits Glade where all of the Kickstarter backers are around. Oh, there's a totem right there! Oh! <laughs> uh, whoops. Boom!
I don't see no totem. I just passed... Oh, it's right here. Ah, I feel so invigorated now. Whee! I'm gonna spend it all to heal myself. <laughs> this is, sounds like a friendly time. Oh, hi! Excuse me, sir. But I must kill you to save my grubby. These guys sound like they're dying. Good lord. Have you tried not sounding like that? There you go, little grubby. Be free. But there's still more to explore. These resting grounds don't seem very restful to me. Oh, look, Geo that we don't need. I love this. Oh, wait, oh, I saw that. I saw that. You can't fool me. Actually, you absolutely can fool me. It's pretty easy. But, oh, like that. See? <laughs> Man, that was just too perfect. Oh, my butt. <laughs> Stop it. You know, every so often, something happens at just the right time, and it's funny. Excuse me, sir. Oh, he deals extra damage. Also, I don't think I sat on the bench in the resting grounds. No, I did not. Or, no, wait, I did. Oh, what a, oh how wonderful. <laughs> They're actually just choking on their frosted flakes, and I'm like, okay, I better kill you. Heimlich Maneuver does not exist. No, I gotta murder. I got to. Whee! <laughs> oh, I passed him. Ow. He's supposed to be right around here. Where has he got to? Where's my shadow? He's supposed to be right over here, but he's not. Perhaps a secret passageway? I don't like it when people lie to me. It says he's supposed to be right around here. Secret like passageway up here, maybe? There's some light shining down from above, but this is not where I want to be. Where's my shadow? Did he just not spawn? I don't like this. Where is he? Points vs. Zombie is extremely long. Every world has like 32 levels, and there's 11 worlds in the game, and so much extra content that they're still making it. Hollowness Seal, cool. But I want to know where my shadow is. I'm not even hearing him. Normally he does that creepy high-pitched... I 
I had a thought. If we get Satan off our shoulder and replace him with the good old reliable spider friends, will our shadow come out? Because maybe our shadow don't want to come out if we got Satan around us, which I would not blame him for. He's supposed to... Okay, he's slightly to the right. It's like he's supposed to be above me. But there's no way to break the ground that's above me. Is he just... I'm literally right on top of him according to the map. I don't know why he's not here. And he's got, like, 8,000 Geo. Oh, it just shows him in the center of the room, but he might be somewhere else? That's dumb, because that's not how literally every other room in the entire game has worked. Okay, map glitch. There we go. Nice job, spider friends. Way to go. Hello. Oh, that's not a person, it's a statue. I get a soul eater. Aw, oh, yes! I don't know what that does, but... Aw, oh, yes! <laughs> spider friends, spider friends. They kick butt, and they're cute, too. Alright, well, there we go. <laughs> Delicious souls. Ooh. Ooh. Time for Super Grover! Oh. Let's see what's in here. Big giant room. Ooh, it's a person. Maybe. The Grey Mourner. Oh, Mahal, this world, this cruel, sinful world. Why does she wake? Why does she persist? I don't know what the accent to give. Ah, oh, le mer, you could not know that tra of tragedy as complete as she's. Two lovers stripped apart. Two worlds that could not meet. And now, Meldava, dead so long in time, dead so far away, buried Monya, ay, amongst its hateful kin that did not deny our union, that did reject Che's outsideness. She doesn't suppose, no, 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 does she sack? Does she burden? Le Maire, would you, could you deliver her to give her a grave? The gift is maybe small, but the trek is long. She rests amongst her kind near our queen's lush refuge. Would such a thing be done? She asks perhaps impossible things, mad things, for Le Maire to take up such a quest would be a kindness she has ne'er forgotten. I don't know what you're saying, but sure. Rare boon you grant Le Maire. It shall be she's last request. After this, never shall she lie a burden on another. A sacred flower is the offering. It is a rare, delicate object. One of a kind. You must cherish it. Must act as though it were your own heart. If you were to get hurt whilst carrying it, or did to attempt to ride those justly transit beasts, it would forever be destroyed. Oh! Her grave lies in the middle of the Queen's overgrown estate. 
It is surrounded by her kind, who will not look kindly on your trespass. Take care, Le Maire. My hopes I place upon you and my fair and wish, that this small solace may come to pass. Uh, so if I die... That's bad, then. Soul Eater greatly increases the amount of soul... Gra oh, dude, if I equip Soul Eater with Soul Catcher... I'll be unstoppable! Yes, a perfect delivery run, apparently. It's like the Wind Waker tree side quest, but worse. Okay, so we can't use any kind of transportation, and we gotta go to the Queen's Gardens, which is naturally, like, basically as far away from here as you can get. Also, did she actually give me anything? Oh, Nemenul, nails and claws, why must it be so? Hmm. By the way, hi, Nintendo Addict, nice to see you. Okay, spider friends, maybe? Maybe I should just equip all the fragile stuff. Just to shake things up a bit. Nah. No, I'll equip Satan again. I don't like doing that, but, uh... I need him in order to get the flames. And I am a sucker for the side quests. So did I actually get the thing that she gave me? Because it didn't seem like she gave me anything. I just... I want to make sure I actually got the thing from her before I travel all the way across the map. I got the delicate fly. Okay, cool. Okay, I'm pretty sure he's growing up to be Satan, though. Wait! I'm sorry. I can't take damage? I thought I wasn't allowed to die. Not I can't take damage. What? Oh, that sucks! What the heck? That's so stupid. She said that if I were to die or take the transit, that it, uh, can I have another one? Oh, oh she's sacred, precious, one of its kind, flower ruined. She's love denied her final gift. Such suffering for she, such misery. She thought she could bear no more. I suppose she does have one more flower, though. But Le Maire, this one is equally sacred and equally fragile. Where's the one to accept such a quest? It must become their precious heart. Would such a thing again be tried? <laughs> then this new sacred one-of-a-kind flower shall give you, as she won before, it must become precious as one's heart while beheld. If you were to get hurt again whilst carrying it, or did attempt to ride those jostling transit beasts, this one too shall be destroyed. Though my faith has once been challenged, my hopes are still with you, Le Maire. I have no idea why she's calling me Le Maire. Okay, well, this does change things. No point in having quick focus if I'm not allowed to take damage. Oh, guys, what if we have the spider friends and Satan? I think that would just be great. Ooh, actually, the balder shell could be really useful here. Mmm. It's true. I gotta keep the way I gotta keep the wayward compass. I want spider friends though. Mmm. Sorry, Grim Child. I want the Balder shell. I also kinda want fragile strength. I'll do it on my own. Okay, how long? How far will I make it this time? Probably not out of this room. Oh, that's right! I kill in two hits now. This is so fantastic. Okay, I can't ride the. Mm. I can't ride the fairy. That's that's annoying. 
can't ride the subway. I've watched me not even be able to find where it is in Queen's Garden. This strikes me as it, the fact that it's going to be a very annoying quest, methinks. Okay, I really don't want to cut through the Forgotten Crossroads. Because that's filled to the brim with annoying enemies. But at the same time, I feel like that's going to be my best bet. Oh wait, no, that's a tram. I can't take the tram. I gotta take the elevator down. I'm assuming when she said don't ride those fearsome transit beasts, she's referring to the subway guy, but also referring to the tram. I'm assuming I can't do either. So much for Grandma. Alright, here we go then. Thought we were going to be working for the circus cult, but, uh... I'm not gonna... I'm gonna give it a serious try. Don't sit on a bench, it'll respawn the enemies that I killed. Fair enough. Alright, we're here in the Kingdom's Edge. Very far away from where we need to go. Not up, down. I am extremely paranoid now. Why does the elevator always default to the direction I don't want it to go? The fact that I can one-hit kill enemies here, though, does seem great. Um, some enemies I will kill. Some enemies I will avoid. These giant guys with the shields? I'm gonna avoid. Okay. So looking at the map, we gotta plan out our route. We can go around here, then we can go up... Into the fungal wastes, then towards the Queen's Garden. Okay. I'm not promising I'm going to be able to complete the side quest, but I'm at least going to try. Okay. So we keep going this way. Uh, I don't know if I can kill you in one hit. I cannot. The fact that you can't take damage at all just sucks. Might as well use my soul for attacks then. <laughs> Curse you! Thought of an idea, kill everything before you accept the quest. Ah, uh, nah, if you have to go from one world to another, I'm sure the enemies respawn. That would be far too easy otherwise. Well, not far too easy, but... Okay, yeah, so we gotta go through here. I hate this guy. I'm gonna avoid him. Uh-oh. No, no! Okay. This is the one I need to go up in. But I'm worried because I'm pretty sure there are some annoying enemies in here. Yeah, I kind of wish this was just a don't die sort of task. Not much point in using the benches, because they just refill HP, not your soul. Okay. Is he 
gonna notice me? He's not. Wonderful. Shoo, alright. I'm going to end up dying to a really easy... or getting damaged by a really easy enemy, I'm pretty sure. Nope! I knew there were annoying enemies. Okay, now I still want to go to the right. I better be able to go through here. Oh, yucky. I took a bit of a gamble there. Because I could have easily gotten damaged by the thorns. I have never been over here before. Okay. Fascinating. I will come back here later when I can go for the forms without needing to risk death. And by death, I mean death of a flower. Man, I can't remember the last time in this game I just was walking everywhere. Okay. Queen's Gardens. Okay, so I've got to go down a little bit and then just to the right. Okay. See, this... Oh! Oh no. Oh, I hate that. Oh, I hate that. Oh, lovely. I can kill those guys in one hit, though. That's fantastic. Whew. Why no? I'm not paranoid. Not at all. Not in the slightest. <laughs> I don't know. I, as a matter of fact, I don't know where in the Queen's Gardens her grave is. Why yes, I am very nervous for that. What if you give the flower to your girlfriend, would she like you again? Well, that is how it works in real life, isn't it? Nah, if if she's willing if she wants to dump me for Zote the what's his face, then I don't want her in my life. I can do better. Gardens are full of spikes, drop off lures, and boomerang. Oh no! You're right! Oh no, I haven't even explored all of Queen's Gardens either. Yucky. Okay, well, gotta find a grave. I'm gonna assume I don't want to touch boiling water while I'm carrying this flower. 
She didn't mention it, but... <laughs> My cakes will burn. That's right, the boomerang cutter guys are the worst. Okay. Maybe... Ooh. So, just looking at the map, the grave could either be in that rectangular room underneath the bench and the subway station room. Or it could be that part to the upper left of the subway station where it looks like a giant beetle on the map. Huh. Or I could be completely wrong about both of those. I read mantises with frisbees as manatees with frisbees, which is much better. Okay. I'm going to try to find the path that has the least amount of uh, mantises. Oh, wait. Could that be a flower petal? <laughs> a dandelion? Whoa. This looks promising. Oh, that's just a bench. I thought it was a pedestal to put a flower on. Hmm. Cornifer was here. I fought the frost. I'm glad somebody got the reference. <laughs> I was quoting the first Ice Age movie. Now, Ice Age as a franchise is not great, but the first one was actually pretty good. And by good, I mean entertaining. Oh, no. Mm-mm. 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 Oh, boy. I hate this. I hate this so much. <laughs> Should I try going all the way around? Okay. Mm. Be a man! <laughs> oh no. I think this is a room that has a lot of, of the manatees. Yep. There he is. Oh, you blood of a freaking dog of I'm gonna murder you for that one. He, his boomerang curved like 180 degrees just to hit me. Oh, you're dying for that one. All the manatees shall die for that one. Was I right next to the freaking grave? Welcome to the Queen's Guard. I know where I am, game. Oh, I forgot about those guys, too. Yeah, I kind of thought she might mark it on the map. I don't know why I thought that. Yeah, I don't think I'm I don't think I'm trying that tonight again tonight. <laughs> I'm at least going to look to see if I can find where the grave is. This looks nice. Oh, we're not in the Queen's Gardens anymore, though. Oh, how silly of me. The manatees are very annoying because it's hard to hit them because they're constantly moving away from you, and apparently they're boomerangs you just can't dodge. The Overgrown Mound. This is the rolling area. Yes, but you also forget. I'm here playing the game to have fun. 
If there's a side quest that's not fun. Maybe I'll come back to it later. Oh, yeah. Okay, 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 okay. So I want to go up from here. So I can go through that rectangular room and start moving up. But this ceiling is in the way. Just like the ceiling in Green Path is in the way when I try to go through there. Of course, you get the most important thing of all. Satisfaction. zippity doo da zippity a Wonderful feeling, wonderful day. Zoom, 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 zoom. Zoom, 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 zoom. Whee! Okay, cool. We're down. Oh, wait. I went down the wrong way. I gotta go down on the left. <laughs> Yuck! Sorry, satisfaction doesn't do it for me. Well... I didn't say that was the only reward you got. You also get a pin that lets you one-hit kill anything, including the final boss. If that's the case, then sign me up. Ow! Oh, my butt! Can we have more goth cat ear and less Satan? Uh, <laughs> you know, that's something I can get behind. Oh, hey! With fragile strength, these guys die in two hits. Assuming that you can hit them... So basically, no matter which way for Queen's Gardens I go, I'm going to have to fight these stupid guys. Oh, that's right. Well, we don't need this anymore. I don't want that anymore. Alright, let's see. Uh, yes. Take that. Now let's go the long way around. Oh, I think this is the area. Because she did mention, like, oh, there will be some fiends that will not be happy to see you if you they see you with the flower. It might be those weird peacock things. Peacock things? That's not what they are. Let's try going up. So maybe if we go this way, aha! Still haven't found the place I'm supposed to bring it. Oh, whoops, should have healed before I did that. This will surely lead us to Green Path. I think my best hope for those guys is to use the Balder Shell to protect myself from the boomerangs. Okay, apparently that hit me my groin. Wonderful. Ow. Whee! Ouch. Take that. Yeah, and there's a grubby on the way as well. I, this is... 
How have I not been this way before? Ow! My bottom! Oh, I see, I see what you're trying to do here. You were putting that guy in the way so I couldn't Super Grover dash. Well, it won't work! You can't stop Super Grover! Oh, I hate that, actually. I only talk about my butt when I impale my butt on the spikes. It's called a running gag. I hope you appreciate that, Grubby. That was a lot of work to get uh, you. Ouch! I don't. Bow! <laughs> no, I am not being dirty. If you step on attack, it is perfectly acceptable to yell, "Ow, my butt!" There you go. Can't stop Super Grover. Oh boy! Essence. That is worse than attack. Oh my gosh, yes! I got the stupid shortcut at last. Do they expect you to travel through this room for the first time going back that way? Uh oh. I have no healing. Well, then I gotta hope I don't die. Oh no, this means I have to play well. Everyone knows I can't do that. Still more in this room somewhere. <laughs> Dark Eye is trying his best to defeat the invincible enemies. He is not succeeding. Oh, there we go. Uh, the last bench I stepped on was kind of a while ago, wasn't it? Oh, also. Oh, hey, it counts that I got the grub at last. Yay! There are no benches nearby. Yay! Oh. Greenkin lost, paths overgrown, dream forgotten. I forgot about my dream, too. I have not played a game called Death's Door. Well, this is how I die. With my crotch stuck in a pile of briars. Not the way I want to go out. Oh, uh, no, I don't actually want to fight him yet. Okay, so we gotta go up that way. Get our shadow back. Oh, hey, there's another way to go that we did not go through. Also, where's that last... Oh, that last flame is in the City of Tears. Er, yeah, that's right. It's over here. Okay. Then be gone. Yes! <laughs> no, actually, the stream is not sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends. I'm not good enough, even for them. They're like, look, we know we ask literally every YouTuber to sponsor us, but not you. <laughs> this video was sponsored by nobody because it was made for the people.
No, guys. Obviously, the stream is sponsored by Surfshark. And NordVPN. <laughs> there is no way I would ever do a sponsor unless it was for something that, like, I really, really, really like and believe in. Like, if Culver's reached out to me and is like, Artie, would you like to sponsor... Would you like us to sponsor you? I'd be like, um, yes. I would love to sit down and tell my stream about how much I love Culver's and how good it is. Because I do that already, <laughs> regularly. But now I get paid for it. <laughs> Culver's doesn't know what they're missing. No, Culver's, not Colmer's. Culver's is a fast food joint that started in, uh, I believe, Wisconsin. I don't have Wooduku, but I do have Count Dooku. I do have a Sudoku uh, app on my phone, but I think it's just like daily Sudoku. Uh, um, uh, well, that was okay. Um, what the heck is going on? Did you guys see that? They were pulling me around like I was tied to them. Like, it was like they were a sled dog and I was the sled attached. They were... What? Uh, I don't think I'm going up there anymore. I'm moving on out. Okay, I want to try. Dark dash is not enough to get us through the darkness. Great. Ow! That's not nice! Alright then, I guess we're not going that way. Oh no, I wasted it already. Ouch, my bottom. It happens when you're in a uh, text chat of any kind. I gotta go to Subway. Not the restaurant, the actual Subway station. <laughs> <clears throat> no, not that way. No, not that way. Okay, yes, this way, this way. Ah, oh, it feels good to sit down. Sorry, spider friends, swapping you out for my new buddy, Dark Bro. <laughs> Come on, Dark Bro. <laughs> Let's go squash out the light. Yeah, Dark Bro. He's, he's my bro now. He's not Satan yet. He might grow up to be Satan, though. Alright. This should be pretty close by. Sounds like the name of a Hammer Brother. <laughs> Hammer Bro, Fire Bro, Boomerang Bro, Dark Bro. That also sounds like the name of a really dumb Sif. This is my apprentice, Darf Bro. <laughs> Sup? Hey, bras. <laughs> Super excited to be a Sith. Do you guys know where the Sith hang out to have f to have a good time? At the Darth Mall. <laughs> See, even that guy laughed at it. Oh, 
Ow. Okay, this... Fighting him in this giant room that's filled with annoying platforming is actually annoying. This is better. See, because the guys that we're killing are so obviously evil, I don't feel bad about killing them. Not that I felt bad about killing literally anything in this game. Because everything's a bug. Everyone knows bug lives are not as valuable as other lives. Besides, Simba, when we die, <laughs> we become corpses, and the bugs eat the corpses, so the circle of life continues. Come on, you can't tell me you feel bad if you swat a mosquito, can you? Flame consumed. They're crying on the inside. Well, see, the Phoenix, I thought about that, and the fact is, I really don't care. <laughs> Ooh! <gasps> oh, oh, guys, guys, guys. I have an idea. Now, I'm, like, pretty sure the game developers would have figured this out and that this would just destroy the flower. What if I find where I need to take the flower, make a waypoint, and just teleport there using my soul? She didn't say we couldn't do that. Bees? <laughs> Beads. Beads! Yeah. This is big brain time. How the heck do we get those two little... Free grubs! And another one. Why are there so many grubs left? I thought I had saved almost all of them. There are free grubs in this area, and I don't know how to get them. I know the bees are making, like, a droning noise. But I swear, from my end... <laughs> It sounds like the bees are going. Alright, surely there's gotta be like a secret passageway in this room somewhere on the right side, right? Right? Why wouldn't there be? Oh, oh, hold. Yes. Aha! Secret beehive. The hive. Oh, there's a new world I haven't even been to? This is giving me DK Country 2 vibes. Except there's no amusement park this time. A whole new world filled with bees. <laughs> Looks like we're in a bit of a sticky situation now, folks. Ah, uh, no, nah, that was too obvious. I'm going to be sure to comb every inch of this hive. Already hauntest? <laughs> well, that's not even clever. <laughs> you just replaced the word, replaced the, the the prefix polka with arty. Doesn't even sound the same. <laughs> Wee! 
Hey, I'll have you know, I liked puns before I knew Chugga Conroy existed. Oh, hey! I don't like bumblebees. They're all bristly. My, my ex-wife is like, wow, you've, you've killed a lot of people. <laughs> That's a bench! Trapped in resin! I mean, honey! No bother. Wait, 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 what's the gold... Oh yeah, the gold fiend is like the big boy on the map. Oh my, I just love the honey! Uh, we don't need Dark Bro anymore. <laughs> We're invading the hive with the spider friends! Aw, yeah! This is our hive now. Everything the light touches belongs to me and the spider bros. Or the spider friends. They're my favorite superheroes. Man, that guy was even making sounds kind of like Winnie the Pooh. Oh! Oh, Piglet. I just love the... It would be great if we saw, like, a Winnie the Pooh reference in here somewhere. If I made a beehive in a video game, you better believe I would make... I would probably put in a reference to Pooh and a reference to Donkey Kong Country, too. Ouch. So basically, I would put, like, Pooh's shirt and Diddy's boombox stuck in, like, the honey somewhere. How lovely. Oh, that was all of them? Oh, really? Hardened tribe. Light familiar. That familiar light you're talking about, they're called the Spider Friends. A plushie of the lost kin? No. There's nothing, there's nothing cuddly about the lost kin. He's made of, like, orange goop. There are free grubbies hidden here. <laughs> the spider friends at this point, it feels like they're, like, just the toddlers, like, Look, I'm helping! <laughs> Look, Papa, I'm helping! Oh my, did he just deal free damage to me? How can you have a plushie of me? <laughs> I don't even make my own merchandise. Oh, if you have a if you have a D blob plushie, then that basically is the same thing. Whoa. A <laughs> chonky bee. The only way you're getting a plush of Artie is if you ever have a plush of D-Blob, or if you made it yourself. If you made it yourself, uh, that's cool. Maybe a little strange, but hey, if, if you post it to the cute things, uh, server, then, uh, yeah. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, I don't like this. You would need to enlist the help of, like, who was that who used to be on the Lemmings forums who, like, actually made toys for a living? Was it Problem? Ask her to make one for you. And then I'll tell everyone that it's a bootleg.
Oh, well, that's true. You make furniture. So, like... Ouch. Probably some similar skills are needed. It's a big boy bee. Jeez, the wheeze. That guy has so much HP and so much attack power. I know I'm I'm a very marketable plushy. That's that's what happens when I'm when <laughs> I literally made my avatar in about 60 seconds in MS Paint. That's the funny thing. No, we're going to the left. We must save Grubby. There's a Bart Simpson plushie. It's true. I think I see him in pretty much every claw machine <laughs> every claw machine I've ever seen. Oh no. You can't go through there. We'll have to find some way around. Uh, music is Flight of the Zener. <laughs> I mean, wait, no. No, it's not. I just realized, in the movie A Bug's Life, there aren't any bees in it, as far as I remember. It's kind of interesting. Okay, low on HP again. Zoop. Proxima plushie would be like a pillow with stars on it. Oh, that's funny. I can destroy stuff in the foreground. That's funny. A Mobius plushie. Uh, good question. I don't know what Mobius looks like. So it's, and he changes his profile picture often enough that, uh... Okay. No! Oh! It ricocheted me off the stupid honeycomb. Sorry, spider friends. Fury of the Fallen, when close to death, the bearer's strength will increase. Do I, do I have to be at 1 HP for that to trigger? Because if it, if it allows me a little bit of leeway, I might go for that. But if it's only at 1 HP, it has to be at 1 HP. Okay, forget it. I'm not doing that. <laughs> I want to try it. <laughs> I'll do that, and then with one left, <laughs> crop soul. I'm going to be swimming in soul. Need more souls. That's weird. Those guys, like, when they die, they create more bees. Hmm. Can't say I agree with that.
Marty's color can be red or pink. She was originally pink, but then she kind of her redesign made her red. We did not model our avatars after the Pac-Man ghosts. At least I did not model mine off of the Pac-Man ghosts. And I assume Marty modeled hers after mine, so... Maybe I'll just try to avoid the big boys. Just like I avoid big boy restaurants. How did that not- I'm sorry, how did that not kill him? I hit him with the upward soul move so many times. Also, I'm sorry, I thought my shadow was in that room. It wasn't. It was some other shadowy thing that flew up to the sky. Um, no it's not. My Discord profile picture is, ouch, is definitely a blue arty. Wait, that's the wrong way to go. Uh Out of here, you bees. Ouch. I don't like the fat boys just staring at me like that. That's not good. Yeah, that's the ch that's my channels. That's my server's icon. My icon is a blue arty with a uh, headset. It's the same as my Twitch profile. I think I feel a boss coming on. Hi! Nice striped underwear. Oh hey, it's, it's like Kinsey and Stain. No, I don't like how you can teleport into me. Rats. Okay. Maybe I went a little overboard with that. I'm gonna need quick focus. Spider friends could be nice too, but I think I'm gonna go with Baldur Shell. I hate how that guy creates bees when he dies. Great.
Sure, let's just bring everybody over here. My birthday party was supposed to be a private event, but sure, if you invite all your friends, what can I do but open the door and let you in? You can you can bring up other streamers occasionally. I just don't exclusively talk about them. And if he, if that's if his like icon is what all the emotes that uh, Proxima's been using, then yeah, it does look very huggable. Maybe ha ha! I've got you on my trap now. <laughs> Can we all just collectively agree? Well, pro probably not. The answer is probably no, but can we all collectively agree that singing happy birthday to the person whose birthday it is is kind of weird and we should stop doing it? It's like, hey, look, all like all these people are just singing this weird child song to you as you just sit there and have to take it. It's like, how about we don't? Okay, I don't like you. The exception being if it is the Polish Happy Birthday song, which is actually really boss. Okay, now I'm getting kind of getting a handle on it. Okay, I can, I think I can get behind this boss. He seems like a fun fight. Uh oh! Now he's doing a Zerg rush. I do not like it when he does this move. So naturally he's gonna do that move over and over again. Oh, he's gone already! Cool! So long, King Bowser! Oh, he's just dead. Sorry, bro, but that's what you get for kidnapping the grubbies. Hive blood? I know you've got grubbies around. Maybe he doesn't have grubbies around here. Let's see. On the map. Oh, hey! It's a ghost! My knight, at last you are freed. Small thing, I know your kind. If you attempt to resolve your past, then know I am not the queen you seek. It is the pale beans that bear blame for your nature. Though this hive exists within Hollow Nest, we play no part in its attempt at pe perpetuation. Is this going to be another Lost Kin situation if I suck you up? No, it's not. I actually do get Essence. I take you with me always. Ooh. 
Doggone you! There are way too many enemies in that room. What does this do? Four notches, eh? Heals the bearer's wounds over time, allowing them to regain health without focusing so what? Um, yes. Sign me up. I bet it's going to be a very slow heal. It is a cool world, to be sure. I'm trying to figure out how to get the grubs. Oh, one of those grubs is way over there. Well, first I gotta get my stuff back. They're not noticing me. Is it because I'm just playing really stealthily, or is it like... No, the hive blood must be making them not... care to attack me. <laughs> that sounds like a fantastic fan art. <laughs> Sounds like the only way to fly. <laughs> Forget flying Delta. I'm flying Chonky B Airlines. Okay, there is. You see, you guys see that passageway up there. Okay, so if I attack them, they'll attack me. Good to know. So do I have to use them as like a footstool to get up? No, surely not. We can do this. Aha! Hardcore parkour! <laughs> There you go. You are free, my grubby. So now I gotta fix. Ooh. Oh, I see what we gotta do. That's what we gotta do. Oh yeah! New heart container! I mean, it's only gonna go downhill and that my maximum potential for physical fitness will go down. I don't expect to let anything else go down. How do we get through there? Oh, I got I got high hopes for the year where I'm 26. It could be a very good year. <laughs> I'm glad I could be of some kind of help. 
Okay, no, I don't think I can get there from here. <laughs> also, holy moly, where did my 20s go? Feels like just yesterday I was 21. Wait, have I not been this way be No, I've been this way before, surely. Then why is that... Hmm. I had not been this way before. Interesting. How do I get to that grub? It didn't look like... From being in the hive, it looked like there was a way I could drop down on top of it from above, so... My health is gold because I have the... Here we go. Boom! My health is gold because I've got the honey badge equipped, which will restore my HP over time without me even needing to heal. Wonderful. Beautiful. Aw, I'm glad to help, DX. I'm sorry you had a bad day. I, I hope tomorrow will be better for you. I was happy to help. And shucks, I, I, I feel like I didn't even do anything. I'm just playing a game and talking during it. <laughs> Everyone's happy except all the bees we murdered. Well, you know, they're not real. Okay, we gotta find the other grub. We're running out of time for the stream, so we gotta find it quickly. Oh no, not freaking shotgun bugs. Gotta say, the health regeneration is even slower than I thought it was going to be. Kill this giant bug. It's true. Birthday stream is going to be interesting. I will probably stream a different game other than Hollow Knight on my birthday. For the special occasion and all that. You're not supposed to be able to get in there. Hmm. Yep. June's a busy month. There we go. Much better. I've already done the Blues Birthdays. 
all two of them, except for some reason, the good one, the yellow disc, got copyright struck. And I didn't even do anything. How am I supposed to get the grubby? He's supposed to be right under here. Hmm. Marty can do it. Oh. There we go. Boom. Marty can do what she wants. Nobody is obligated to watch my streams. Oh. It never fails. You go to read Twitch chat and then a hundred enemies show up. I don't like that guy's positioning. Not one bit. Ow! Stop it! It's a lot of work for one grub. complicated. <laughs> I destroyed the area, but I didn't actually go down to go. Okay. That's true. There could be more down here than just a grub. Okay, well, that was a lot of stuff to just pass. Okay, you can't just bring me to a dead end with nothing here and expect me to not Assume there's something here. Hmm. You can't tell me there's nothing in here. There's a giant empty mirror here. I need that spore badge. I don't know about that. The spore badge just damages enemies that are near. Uh oh. I'm out of magic. I need to top off on my soul. Great, now I gotta remember to enter through there. Oh hey, I got some soul back. And I'm gonna get a little bit more. Get back here, you coward. Oh, <laughs> summer solstice, I get it. Summer solstice is nice. Good lord, this just keeps going deeper and deeper.
I mean, what's there to think about the summer solstice? It's the longest day of the year. The end. Woo! Lots of geo that I have no use for. How wonderful. Is that really all that was down here? Just a butt ton of geo? I guess that's it, the case. Alright, cool. The fact that there's no music in here is kind of weirding me out. There we go. Also, wow, that health regeneration is just not working. There you go, little grubby. Be free. I did all of everything I do. I do it for you. I guess the big guy just kind of left. What was I saying? Uh, you know, it would it would be too weird to, un uh, to explain. I was seen in a made-up song from a TV show. <laughs> yes, that classic song, Everything I Do, I Do for Artie Bucks. It was not from Arthur, as a matter of fact. <laughs> very, very different show than Arthur. It's from a live-action show. Although it does also start with the letter A. What's this? A quick slash? Oh my gosh, does that let me attack faster? Why was that hidden in like the last world of the game? Let me ask you something, Sensazaras. Does Sesame Street start with the letter A? Sesame Street might be brought to you by the letter A, but it does not start with the letter A. Alright, I got a DEEP! Ah! 9,400 Geo. Oh, bef before I leave, let's see. It's a quick slash. Born from imperfect discard nails that diffuse together, allows the bearer to slash much more rapidly. Yes. Why would I not want that? Oh! Where have you been the whole game? Come, spider friends! We murder everything! <laughs> so if we go back to the map... How many grubs do we have left? We've got one over in the City of Tears. We got one in the Royal Waterways, one in the Ancient Basin. Is that it? That might be it, as far as grubs are concerned. We might be able to finish up the grub hunt in next stream, which will be happening next Monday, everybody. So, if we can finish up the grub hunting and continue with the Circus Malurcus, that would be, uh... That would be pretty nice. 
But we are out of time for this stream. That was a fun one, though. We got to explore a beehive. We got to rescue some grubbies. We learned about this terrible flower quest that I definitely don't want to do. <laughs> yeah, this is going to be fun. And remember, just a reminder, no stream this Saturday. But there will be a stream on Sunday. And it will be the new Saturday stream series, and I think I finally decided on something. You'll have to figure out what that is on Sunday, though. Thank you all for joining in. It was a pleasure talking with you all. And I had, I had a blast tonight. So... Look forward to next stream. I wish you all a fantastic rest of your night, and God bless everybody.